YouTubers? Is he a crazy British bloke? Yep, I'm on my way over to Joe's. Um, I think it's time to sell the snowmobiles. It's winter, be a good time to sell them. We haven't been out in them. You know, they're, they're a bit old for taking on the trails around here and spending all that sort of money, considering we don't really get a lot of snow. You know, and as for dragging them right up north or something, they're really not that reliable for that, so, I don't know, we're gonna see if we can sell them. Maybe someone's got a farm they wanna pot around on with them. You know, they're good little snowmobiles, they run all right, so, I'm gonna try and drag those out today. Uh, what else am I doing today? Yep, gonna get a text later on from Pug, and I'm going to meet him down at the vape shop. He's going down there to get some vaping gear. So, well, you'll see that on his video, won't you? Um, yeah, so I'll take you along, show you what I'll get up to today. Well, it seems to be running. It's not brilliant, but it needs the, uh, just needs the carbs cleaning out. You see? Oh, she goes when you poke her. Few days. We need snow, but we don't snow for a while. Well, so it just needs a brake adjusting on that. Yeah. Great. <laughs> there you go. And if we want some sleds, there they are. Well, what a freezing cold day, eh? Um, well, as you see, got them running, eh? Yeah, that amazed me. I never thought they'd bloody start, but they did. So, must be uh, the stabilizer that we put in the gas. But they're both running all right. Uh, the 650, one of the uh, the brake pads are just binding a little bit. Um, you know, it just needs messing around with where it's been sat. Uh, other than that, they run great. And I think Joe's one just needs a screen on it. But, you know, they're both up for sale. I think he's going to sell that Equinox pod thing. You can see that in one of my videos if you go and have a look. And you see what it's like. We had great fun with that. Uh, yeah, it's all for sale. Uh, I'm on my way now. Over to meet Pug, a tasty vape, and uh, yeah, see what he's going to uh, what he's going to buy himself over there. He's going to make a little video, I think, and uh, I think I might buy myself a rebuildable. That's what I'm going to do, and then buy some camphor wire and some cotton, and uh, have a go at rebuilding one. You know, I think that's the next step. See what it's like. So, anyhow, I'll. Uh, I'll get back to you in a while. Right then, tubers, I'm home now. Um, had a great time. Great meeting with Pug down at the vape store. Tasty Vapes. Uh, watch his video, you'll see it. You'll see a link to their site and everything. And everything they do. And didn't he do well, eh? He got some nice nice bit of kit down there. Um, what else did I do? Oh, yeah. I, uh, let me show you this. 
I bought myself some cotton buds and you'll wonder why I've got some cotton buds and also I bought this look it's one of those uh, head things with uh, you know all the magnifying glass bits in it and that and that's because oh, sounds like Bobby's on the phone that's because I bought myself Bobby Bobby you always ring up when I'm videoing I'll get back to you in a minute I bought myself one of these smoke tech RSSTs and this is a, a rebuildable atomizer and I'm going to use that cotton and I've got some camphor wire here it's quite a nice little device it's not a you know, absolutely brilliant one but it'll do for a starter for me to uh, do some rebuildables I don't know if you've seen it on Adam's site but he started getting into a few of those and I'm going to put some this in it as well some goose juice it's really good it's like custody comes from the Quax juice factory so I'm going to be vaping on that with this um, I want to get it all together so that's what I'm going to be doing this evening so it was a great day uh, you see the skis we got the old uh, snowmobiles going they're up for sale like I said um, don't know. I'll talk to you again maybe tomorrow or maybe whenever bye bye